Hey guys, welcome to Maths with a Sumnofu. In this video, we are going to learn how to find the distance between two points on a Cartesian plane. For us to do that, we will first of all locate the points on the plane. We are told to find the distance between point Y that has a coordinate of 9 and 7 and point Z that has a coordinate of 15 and 11. First, this is the X the x coordinate 1 and this is the y1 and here is x2 and this is y2. So for us to do that, we'll first of all represent it on a Cartesian plane. Here is called the x axis, y here is called the y axis. So let's locate point M on the plane. Point M has x at point M has a coordinate of x to be 9. So let's use this point to be 9 and has a y uh, coordinate to be 7. Let's use here to be 7. So we can now locate point y to be at this particular point. This is y, meaning uh, 9, uh, 9, 7. Then let's locate point z. Point z has x to be 15. So here can be my 15 and has y to be 11. Here can be my 11. So let's locate point Z. Point Z can be located here. This is Z, which is uh, 15, 11. So to find the distance between this point and this point here, uh, you can now see that we can actually work out a right angle triangle at this point now. So here is can simply be seen as the x2 minus the x1. That's the distance here. x2 minus x1. Y here is the y2 minus y1. So, so to find the distance between these two points, here becomes actually the hypotenuse. And here is what we are expected to find. To do that, you can now see that the distance between two points D which is here, let's represent here to be d. d squared, applying Pythagoras rule, is equal to uh, y2 minus y1 all squared. Are you getting it at this point? Squared plus x2 minus x1 all squared. So on getting this, you can now see that d is equal to what is y2 minus y1? y2, y2 is 11 minus y1 is 7. Okay, so uh, 11 minus 7 is basically is 4. We have it as 4 squared plus what is x2 minus x1? 15 minus 9. 15 minus 9 is the same thing as 6. You have it as 6 squared. So you can now see that 4 squared is 16 plus 6 squared is 36. So and that's d squared basically. So if you add 16 to 36, you have it to be... Okay, so d squared is equals to 52. To find D, just take the square root of both sides. If you take the square root of both sides, D is equal to is equals to seven point two, and that's.